Hi, betting experts. On Monday, the 20th of December, we're off to Musselburgh in Scotland on Monday. A competitive card, the ground drying out all the time. Good to soft at the time of recording. I'm thinking it's all about speed round Musselburgh and course specialists who handle the track. We start off with our value angle selection in the 12.45. This is the happy 50th birthday Kirsty McIntosh Mayor's Handicap Hurdle. Two miles, class five, four-year-olds and up. It's just over two and a half thousand pounds on offer to the winner. I think this is a really good opportunity for Jim Goldie's course specialist Savi. Now this mare, she's six years old. I actually uh, was amazed at looking into her career record. She's actually run 63 times under rules, obviously mixing the flat, the all-weather hurdles. It's pretty extraordinary to be honest. She's run 31 times over hurdles. She's been in the frame on eight occasions, winning twice. She's undoubtedly quirky. She runs at every meeting virtually at Musselburgh. I don't think really she got home over two mile four last time out. She hasn't done in the past really. Um, she needs a bare two miles with plenty of pace on and swoop late. She's extremely quirky in front, but Harry Reid knows her well. He's been on board on numerous occasions and takes over from a claimer who's been on the last twice, which is, I think is a plus. And uh, Savi, if a mark of 99, really should be competitive here on drying ground that suits. If you go back to October, she finished a really good second behind Constancio, held up last by Harry Reid and just failing to get up. Um, from that prolific winner of Donald McCain's. Good makeup here. I think somewhat cloud is likely to lead. Set a good pace. There's a couple of others who hopefully will be duelling up front. She needs finessing. She needs the cards to fall right. But at the prices, I think she's well worth chancing. For our nap of the day, we go to the 115. This is the Watch on Racing TV Novices Handicap Chase. Two mile, four furlong, 68 yards, a class four. The four-year-olds and upwards, £4,684 on offer to the winner. This looks a gilt-edged opportunity for Nick Alexander's very progressive Broadway Joe to complete a hat-trick. Now, the yard, a stable I really like, excellent on social media. Got some lovely young horses, three winners in the last 14 days at a 20% strike rate. Hughes' book, this one was a winning hurdle though slightly frustrating he did win one from nine over hurdles but he's always looked to chase so he returned from 183 days off from a mark of 95 to make a winning chasing debut at Kelso on good ground from Little Orange his jumping warming up as the race wore on and he defied a six pound high mark over this course and distance at the start of November under McMenamin very heavily supported and winning by four and a half lengths there jumping well um, he's got loads of scope to keep on improving. I think seven pounds is probably lenient. He's been given seven weeks off to freshen up again. Hughes is up for the first time. Conditions to suit, drying ground ideal. He should take an awful lot of beating with another fluent round of jumping. Best of luck on Monday, betting experts. Mm-hmm.